you're basically casting a net and going, who's got a problem that I can solve? And the inevitable consequence of that is, for every 10 people, you'll get one or two who you just genuinely can't. The two you genuinely can't will be two who should say yes quite quick, which has happened. It's the six in the middle that now we're about to focus on. And that is how we've evolved this over a period of time. Three, four, five years. And it's not even me, this is just how the game plays with most businesses. For every 10 people who respond who've got back pain, two of them will want more if it's positioned to them in the right way. It's, in, 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 if you don't believe that, you're trying to defy the law of life, which is 80-20. For every single person, who, or 80 percent who buy something, 20 percent want more. It's the fundamental law of everything, from plane travel, to train, to shops, to clothes, to your own buying behavior, that you walk out to the, to the shopping mall that day to buy something, and only to buy that one thing, 20 percent buy something else when you're in there, on everything. And we're not that unlucky or that special that it doesn't include PT, because it's a human being at the end of the day. So we figured out, and um, I work on the principle that for every 10, if we have that conversation, two will go and call one. Two, two out of 10 should go and call one. This guy's got two out of three on call one. That's what I'm saying, it's a sensational response that you've already got. Two will be rude, and two will say no, no matter what we do, and that's fine. It's the six in the middle where you're gonna make your money. It's the six in the middle that will make the difference that is the difference to what you want to have happen in your practice when it comes to direct marketing. So remember, leads are people who are making inquiries. If you wanted to know the difference, even as you look on your websites, and as I, as I speak to the girls about how we set our ad campaigns up, if somebody opts in for a free report, they're a lead. If somebody opts in for a phone call, they're a prospect. They're in a different buying place. That makes sense. So if I offer somebody a free report and they take it, they're at the bottom of the of the um, of the pyramid almost. So you've got your um, sorry lead down here. You've got your prospect. You've got your let's call them. Uh, I'm going to call them a customer at this point for this reason. That could be almost a little pyramid that you have going. So you've got a lead, and ultimately the goal is to get 170 leads, right? So in Trevor's well now, he's got 170 leads. Of those 170, two have already advanced, sorry. Two have already advanced to customer, right? in terms of a first session. I would always class them as a, until they've bought the package or they've gone two, three, four sessions, they're not really a client. And it's just a good way that I never assume that they're gonna go on. Don't assume that just because you've got a client or, or somebody in your schedule that they're gonna be a customer, a client. So if I keep them this, customer is a one-time purchase. They don't become a client until they buy from you repeatedly in a, in a business setting. So if Trevor's down here, he's got 170 leads, right? He's already got two to a cent to customer. Now, what he might be able to do is go, okay, can I get you, uh, let's say if this was the admin, right? The, your admin's doing this. You might go uh, to three of them. Can I just get you on the phone with one of our PTs this week? And then we've got five in the prospect phase. And then he's got two from customers, okay? Hopefully, he converts those two patients from their first session to a full plan of care. And then once he's got them up the top here, it's like, okay, in Kim's case, how can we get them into a Pilates class? where they come back once every month. And that's how businesses set up. Everywhere, everything, every pyramid starts like this. A lead, a prospect, a customer, a client, and ongoing. Thanks for watching this video. And if you found it helpful, and if you now find yourself thinking, I wonder what else this person can help me with, head over to paulgoff.com forward slash books, where you can find my best selling books which will show you how to add more profit to your practice. Or send an email to paul at paulgoff.com to ask about how we can help you accelerate the growth and profitability of your clinic. And by the way, if you know anybody who would find this helpful, please share this video out. Thanks so much.